last year, two very beautiful young women came and found me, accosted me in fact, in Scusies, and they said they wanted to do a show. And they were tired of having to try and sell their, their, their bodies and their singing and their minds to the sort of general industry because actually the general industry is transforming so radically that they weren't sure even who they were anymore. And we discussed the project and we agreed that it seemed that identity was the issue and the question of Jewish identity in South Africa in particular. And uh, it's a topic close to my heart. If you think of the plays of Sophia Town, or the Jewish girl at the heart, or, or, the, or, the, or the, the nightclub singer in Tooth and Nail, or even um, some of the scenes in the earliest works we did in Junction Avenue, there's always a Jewish personality because many of the people in Junction Avenue were Jewish. And so, in my case, I thought, this sounds really interesting, and I happen to know they both sing like angels. And they told me that there was someone else that they knew who sang like a little mini-god. And so, I met them all in a room, in fact, in the market theatre, and we improvised around storytelling. And we've been working at this for a year, and I think it's a beautiful project, I really do. And it's very simple and very pure. They simply tell stories of how their ancestors, their family, their grandparents, their parents got to South Africa from Russia, from Poland, from Israel, in, via Persia, from America, via Jerusalem, when God relocated. The stories are very funny and very poignant because they are so located in truth. We've committed to telling these stories and here they are.